Hello everyone, today in this video we will be discussing about the module 2 super important question which is having the 12 marks but you don't have to remember much concepts, only 4 concepts you have to remember and you can easily score 12 marks so make sure you watch this video till the end, how do you remember the concepts and before starting make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and without wasting more time let's get started <coughs> so what uh, do you need to keep in mind is um, they have asked the 4 questions what is HDFS block replication, HDFS safe mode, lack awareness, name not high availability let's discuss each one by one, what are the key points in that you need to remember the first one is HDFS block replication. What do you mean by block? Block means something like a block, right? That is also that is only what's a block. Replication means copying it somewhere else, like making a copy of it. HDFS is Hadoop distributed file system. You'll be having some uh, storage and you'll be copying that block. Why are we copying the block? That's the main point. So here, when HDFS writes a block, it is replicated across a cluster. Why do we copy something and make a, a replica of it? Why do we backup things? In case this gets failure, we'll be uh, uh, using the backup thing, right? That's why only here also when there is a failure we'll be using the block thing okay that's the main concept uh, concept you keep in mind if nodes are more than eight the replication value set as three means if there is more than eight nodes each node will be having three copies and if nodes are less than eight the replica value will be two this is the second key point the third key point is each uh, uh, replica node will be available to all the other nodes if it's not available there is no point in having the replicas right and you have to make this example here we have the five nodes basically the five nodes are there and each of these will be having two um, uh, nodes with each like one three three four 4, 3, 5, and each of these are unique, okay, no, uh, no other nodes are repeated, each will have 2-2 two, two replicas, okay, that's an example you can make easily in your own words, that was about the uh, first one, this module you have to write 4 key points in this diagram, you can easily score 4 marks, okay, next we have HDFS safe mode, safe mode means uh, it should be safe, right, safe means no one should be able to copy it, no, no one should be able to make any changes to it, that's what uh, is called the safe mode, that's the main key point in that, you just uh, start from uh, this point, when name node starts, it enters the safe mode, what is name node, a node which is a uh, uh, having the main name and all the uh, corresponding stuff it will do okay when it starts it will enter the safe mode what does safe mode do it is in the read mode condition where it cannot be replicated or modified this is the second key point you have tried the third key point is two important process happen the previous file is reconstructed and mapping between the block is created even if it doesn't make sense write this you will get the marks okay done you have the rack awareness rack awareness means which uh, rack you are in the awareness of that okay that means rack awareness if the data is present in some box the box is the rack and the awareness for the uh, data is called the rack awareness okay so what's the first thing you have to write it deals with data locality where is the data stored that is the data locality it deals with the data locality is called rack awareness how is the data going to know what structure it is in that is also called the rack awareness then we have the three levels of data locality in which we can store the data it resides on the local machine it is the best Best one if it's rack, uh, lying on the same rack it is the better one if it's lying in a different rack that is the good one okay moving on to the last question we have name node high availability name node means this is the main concept in the hdfs uh, storage name node high availability why do we need to have high availability if it is uh, causing some failure at that time it should be available right because if the main node is uh, switched off everything will be gone right name node is a single point of failure that could bring down the entire hadoop so name node should be highly available so for that we'll be having a separate uh, two of name node called as uh, the fake name node okay so some methods were applied to avoid this one but it was of no effect because when name node fails everything will be getting shut down so uh, for that uh, the concept of name node high availability concept was introduced it will be having a replica of name node but it will not be in the active mode but it will be in the standby mode when will it come into help in the case of event failover when name node fails the standby mode will be turned to active mode and it will come into the help okay so this is basically what you have to make very easy make three boxes here three boxes here whatever you want you can write here and here active node you have to write here standby name uh, name node you have to write here that's all make sure the like button subscribe to my channel for more deals like this and thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one